Uh, what else we got here in Wombat's news and stuff? Bio this this Bio Mutant game got announced, right? Yes, that did get announced. It looks cute. I think that'll be out next year, though, right? Yeah, but it looks it looks pretty good to me. I mean, they haven't shown any gameplay yet, but the idea of an open world RPG where you play as like Rocket Raccoon that turns into lizards, I'm in, I'm on board. Yeah, it's from some of the ex Just Cause guys. Yep, and I do enjoy Just Cause. There's so. there's pandas flying around with bat wings. This yeah. looks pretty insane. It looks good. It does look insane. No, it looks like it could this. This looks like it's either going to be a, a like an an excellent under the radar release that comes out and hopefully blows us all away, or it's going to be a big dis- big disappointment. So I'm hoping for A. The screenshots make it look like it's really far along. I think it is. I I thought it was like I I don't know when it's going to come out, but I thought it might be early next year. But I could just be making that up. Hmm. These screenshots look like fake news. Your fake news. They look really good, right? Like, yeah. Too good. I they, don't know. Yeah. Let's they, whatever. They I, look. We'll see. They look awfully good. But I'm I I look forward to that. I like games like this. Mm-hmm. Yep. What else? Um, I've been playing a couple other games. Um, Songbringer. Mm-hmm. I, I, that's What's coming that? out here soon. Um, it's, you know, uh, what, is, what was it? Swords and sorcery or whatever that was called. Is that what it was on the iPhone? Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. It's oh, got they have that, another game. No, it's, it's not from them, but it's that got that same kind of art style. Okay. Um, the, the pixelated kind of, I don't know. They remind me of Intellivision style people. Oh, I see what they look like. Yep. Mm -hmm. They're like old Um, Sierra uh, games. What's that game? Yeah, like Uh, old Sierra games. What was that game where you where when you died you came out like a Broforce style? Yeah, it's got it's got a little bit of that. Actually, not a hero. Maybe. Mm -hmm. Uh, Mm -hmm. This is a a Zelda style game. Oh, like a top down. Yeah, Legend of. Like old, old, old Zelda. Zelda. Zelda's the kid in the green with the bow and arrow. Mm-hmm. That is mm-hmm. him. All right, just check. so you start off, you get go into a cave, you grab a, a sword, and and you get going. Uh, you go into dungeons, you fight bosses. It's it's pretty cool. It's pretty slick. Um, apparently, there's like procedurally generated stuff as well, but each each game is self-contained. So like you kind of would have to start a new game or something to get the, like you get a whole new map t- type of thing. Um, I'm three dungeons in, I believe. Uh, I think there's nine in each game, but it's, it's pretty good. Um, I had not heard of it. Apparently it was, I think it was a Kickstarter at, at some point. So it's coming out for steam. Uh, Xbox and PlayStation 4. Uh, that's Songbringer? September. Songbringer. Yeah. Uh, I don't know exactly what the title means, but it keeps telling me I need to get back to Songbringer. And I feel like I've missed something where it told me what that was. Or maybe right. not. <laughs> it sounds like it could be like a sword or something. His sword is humming. So maybe. Mm-hmm. Maybe. It's got the bombs. You lay the bombs. It's got, he uses his top hat that you find as a boomerang. So it's kind of quirky. I like it. Uh, And then I've also been playing, I know Wombat played a little bit of it too, because I saw uh, how bad his scores were at it. Um, (laughs) Oh yeah, I'm terrible. uh, The the Metronomicon Slay the Dance Floor edition. Uh, This is coming out soon for... PS4 at least that's what we've been playing it on. Uh mm-hmm. we got we got codes for it. The I don't Cheapy, did you ever play this on PC at all? No. I've never even okay. seen this before. Okay. This is a RPG that you play like a a rhythm game to to uh-huh. do all the attacks and battles and everything. 
So arrows are coming down the screen and you, you swap between your four characters and hit the patterns and they do attacks and heals and all that good stuff. Uh, Wombat, why, why are you so bad at this game? Um, because I don't have dexterity apparently. So that, and I only played it really once, but I liked it. It's cute. Yeah. It's I, a cute I th- little rhythm game. I, I like you can it. play with a controller. Something about the arrows. I feel like is it needs to, the graphics need to be a little bit better just with the arrows, which is a really, maybe that's what it is. I think that, yeah. Mm. There's something like very boilerplate about the arrows. <laughs> Everything else looks nice. Um, and maybe they're just making it that way so it doesn't get too busy. But I don't know. Something something was off with that. But the rest of it's it's pretty cool. I guess you can play it uh, multiplayer as well. Like different people. And you can, can play it with play. a guitar if you wanted to, too. Yeah, I, I need to try that because I'm not sure how that works. Give it a shot. Let me know if it's better or worse. <laughs> Will do.